Right now, ladies and gentlemen, we should like to take you to a feature in the World Wrestling Federation magazine. And indeed, a feature right here on Championship Wrestling. With that in mind, we take you now to Piper's Pit. Well, here we are again in Piper's Pit, the place that pulls no punches at all. I have finally found another man that had guts enough to come on and face possible harassment from Piper's Pit. His name is Dr. David Schultz. <laughs> it's as simple as this, Doctor. I have a question that has been brought to my attention that I know the answer to, but the public doesn't. And I know for a fact that you have asked for fights from anybody in the WWF. You have asked for fights with Rocky Johnson. You have asked for fights with Tony Atlas. And I myself saw Rocky Johnson and Tony Atlas in, in the asking for those fights actually break down. All of a sudden, Rocky Johnson gets a sore rib. All of a sudden, Tony Atlas has got to go home and plow the fields. Tell us, what is it like to be such a fighter that intimidates other people so much that a man cannot even get a fight? You know I wrestled at the AWA a long time, and I went there and I begged. I got on my knees and I begged somebody to come out and fight me. Nobody wanted to fight me. Nobody thought they could match me in the ring. Nobody wanted to sign their name. So I come to the WWF, baby, where the toughest in the world is wrestling right now. And it seems like I'm having the same problem that I'm having everywhere else. Nobody wants to face me man to man and prove who is the best. And I want to say one other thing. It's a pleasure for me to be sitting out here with one man that feels no fear from anybody whatsoever. And that's you, Ronnie Piper. I want to tell you, it's a pleasure to know somebody like you. Thank you. Just a few more truisms from the pit of Piper. Thank you.